YouTube. What's good, guys? It's your boy TD, and I'm back again with another video from Fantasy Good Sports. And today's video, guys, is going to be on a team that you should be going and trying to stack on in fantasy football. Yes, you know how you can get the running back, the wide receiver, and the quarterback? I got an offense for you, and this offense is the Los Angeles Chargers. I said what I said. The Los Angeles Chargers stack that team in fantasy football. Yes, guys, so listen, this is like, this is several other stacks out there that I like, right? But this is probably my most biggest stack that I'm trying to stack, right? If I can, if it's the draft fall this way. And that's Justin Herbert, Mike Williams, and Austin Eckler. Yes, Austin Eckler, Austin Eckler. Austin Eckler. Yes, guys, I'm stacking those three guys. So let me give you a couple reasons why that this is probably your number one stack. Okay. So you we seen the way that Coach Brandon, um, how he coached Justin Herbert last year, right? Stangley, I think that's how you say his name. Um, he let him go. I loved it. Justin Herbert grew so much last year because the coach said, "Go ahead, Justin, play fourth down and three, go for it. We not kicking no field goals." That's the team that I want. That's the type of offense that I want to target in fantasy football. They going for it on fourth down. On the other side, on their own side of the field. Not just on the field goal side or the scoring side of my side of the field. No, they actually go, go forward on fourth down anywhere. And I love to target a team like that, right? So Justin Herbert this year, guys, he learned so much. He's going to be, I mean, he's going to have 35 target uh, attempts a game throwing the ball. That's the type of volume that can give you a QB1. Okay, so let's move on. We know what Justin Herbert, right? He's the phenom. I actually call him the GOAT, baby GOAT. I think after Tom Brady retired, this is going to be the next GOAT in the league. That's just my two cents on it. But let's move on. Let's move to Austin Eckler. Yes, Austin Eckler. Austin Eckler. Austin Eckler. Yes, Austin Eckler, guys. Austin Eckler is a guy, he's probably the best PPR back out there. Now, listen, they know that they can't give him the ball 25 times a game. But between 15 and 20, he's dominant. And so uh, that's why I'm big on this. I love a PPR, Austin Eckler is a top three, top five running back easily. And standard, he's top 10. But in PPR, he's probably the best running back to go after with Alvin Kamara going through his situation. So I'm big into Austin Eckler. Yes, Austin Eckler. So um, also, guys, um, they use him around the goal line. They don't have to just they don't have to just give him PPR targets. No, they actually want him to score. So his touchdowns can possibly 10 plus easily. So I love that. Also, so let me move on, guys. Also, Mike Williams. Now, I know a lot of you was like, well, you're not bringing up Keenan Allen? No, I'm not bringing up Keenan Allen, bro, bro. Nope, I'm not. I'm bringing up Mike Williams. And the reason why they gave Mike Williams a new deal because this is where this offense is going to. Keenan Allen is going to be is a is a solid wide receiver. He's a good wide receiver. Uh but is he's getting older. So he's just the kind of a catch guy, right? In between the hashes, getting catches. But Mike Williams is the touchdown guy. So if they can't give it to Austin Eckler to score the easy touchdown, then the fade ball is coming to Mike Williams if you want on one out there. He's 6'5", runs a 4'4", right? Guys is a, is a phenom athlete, right? Um, he just needs to stay healthy. That's the only thing. So listen, I'm gonna give you, if y'all want to maybe not go after Mike Williams and go after Keenan Allen instead, I think you okay, right? Um, I wouldn't necessarily want four guys on this offense, but I feel like you could still be okay because you would be what I call squeezing it, like like juice. You get all the juice out of there, right? So same thing with this offense. You, if you squeeze the Chargers, you're going to get a lot of points, even if you have all four of these guys, but I would just recommend three. So I love Mike Williams. I love Justin Herbert. I love Austin Eckler. Yes, Austin Eckler. Yes, I love these guys. Now, so listen, I'm not going to hold you up on this video. I'm not going to keep repeating myself. But make sure you smash the thumbs up button. And also subscribe to this channel. This is cutting edge content, guys. Nobody else really gives you content the way I give you content, right? Also, guys, go subscribe to my OnlyFans. If you want to get into a listener league, guys, I'm telling you, I'm already in a dynasty. I got several other leagues coming for best ball redraft. You want to be in there. Low stake leagues, 20 bucks. And also high stake leagues. You can just think of it. Whatever you can imagine, yes, it's going to be here, guys. So you want to make sure you get in these leagues with aficionados, experts, celebrities, and all, guys. You want to make sure you get in there. So, guys, y'all have a blessed day.